everyone, it's Bobby Joe, and welcome to my home. I am coming to you with a few products that I received from Panalisa Official Store on AliExpress. Um, the products was sent, were sent to me so that I could make some projects and um, review what you know, how I like the items. And I was sent both um, some paper as well as some dyes. However, there's quite a bit, a bit of paper here, and I want you guys to see um, what's inside them so you can make your decision on what you'd like to buy. And then I'm going to put together the dies um, and then show you those. But I'm also going to be making some projects um, uh, later uh, after that in order to let you see how, some uses that you can get out of them. Um, so this is what I figured I'd do because we do have a few paper pads to go through. So I will just jump right in. And these are by, um, you can see on it, it's by Panalisa. Panalisa. There is her little logo. So this first one's called Ombre. So let's take a look. I want to thank um, Panalisa Craft for letting me review and uh, make projects for these. So this is 12 di different designs of two sheets each. So, oh, look at that. Beautiful. Oh, look at this one. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, you'd like that one, Thelma. Oh, these are stunning. Stunning, stunning, stunning. And they're good weight. They're not really heavy, but they're not paper either. Um, they're going to be really good because for for um, cards, I want the least amount of bulk as I can get. Um, so it's really good to have uh, that middle ground. But you can see there's there's quite a bit of weight to them. And that one. Oh, I like that one too. Great for a men's card. Look at these. Again, great for uh, vintage. I don't know. I don't know what that, sm that smell is, but I like the smell. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but I like it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's pretty look. Oh, stunning, stunning, stunning. And then the back one. Oh, love, love, love. Beautiful. And they're flat. Uh, these are um, a matte finish. So my preference. Okay. I mean, I'm not going to put these back in the things because I don't want to keep you too long. I just want you to see the paper right now and then I will make some projects. So this one here, um, that one was ombre. This one I don't see. It's Panalisa for sure. I know that, but I don't see a name on it. But I'm going to be putting all of the links to these below. Oh, look at that. Ah, oh, vintage, I love you. Yeah, she had me at vintage on this one. These make awesome, awesome backgrounds. 
I have some of the polka dot ones with the in, in vintage as well. And yeah, I've I am down to the bare minimum now. Oh, this is nice and dark. Good background. Oh, the roses. Beautiful. Look at this sheet. Oh, gorgeous. Oh, birds. And got a J there. Cardinal, a robin, a, a chickadee, all the good ones. Beautiful. That's a beautiful page. This is good background. Wow, look at the colors in that. And then this is a wood finish. Really nice. I am very, very impressed. You guys know I'm a big vintage, vintage girl, but... But I like other non-vintage things, too, so... <laughs> I do... I do like the wide variety, but yes, it had me at the ditch for sure. This one here, let me see. I'm going to see if I can get... I'm just going to see if I can get... Um, if they do have names um, for these ones. Because I do have a couple of them... Bear with me here. I'm hoping I can. Yeah. I'll just put the links below. Um, and yeah, this one is has to do. Oh, I wish I remembered the name. Drives me crazy. Yeah, no, I'm not, I'm not quickly finding it, but definitely we'll put the links down below. So you've got your cover, Himalayan plants, great greenery. She is so cute with her little wings. Oh, that's nice. I like the simple yet elegant ones. Oh, nice little cut parts. Look at this one here. Even very nice. Oh, just a basic green and green and background. Oh, you can use these for so so many things. Oh, and the beautiful butterflies. Can never go wrong with butterflies. It's nice looking like character. What is it? Terracotta color. This is beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Oh, it looks like, this one here looks like it's almost homemade paper. It's got all the different papers in it. Beautiful. You could, you could do, like, you could use these as a, a background or an element or what have you. But you could also cut these and use them as strips in your, in your pro projects as well. So, 
really good uh, Kind of like a specimen one. Very pretty. And that one there. Oh, they're stunning. It's too bad. I, 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 like, it's a lot. The video doesn't do them justice for sure. This one here is called Fairies. Again, it's, uh, these are all by Panelisa. And this one's called, this is 6x6, six six, 12 designs. All of these, it looks like they're about the same weight. Oh, look at the colors. Oh vibrant really nice i love this beautiful That really, like, this adds to it. Oh, look at that pink. Wow. Look at that pink. Stunning. I love that. I love everything. That's the problem. <laughs> Especially when it's vintage. Look at that blues. Oh, look at that. The colors in this is are so vibrant. Like they're just so oh. This is kind of a similar thing where it almost looks like somebody made homemade paper out of scraps from the, but it's not. And again, you could use these not just as background. Gingham print. Same. And some more gingham. Really nice set. Getting on 13 minutes. All right. This is called Romantic. Cover, uh, I'm definitely using those covers after the. Oh, look at that. <gasps> Love her. These prints are beautiful. Oh, I really like that one, too. Look at that ticket. Doesn't it look great? Oh, look at this one. The 
those who are new here, I'm um, big vintage girl, but I'm slowly getting some color into my into my um, projects slowly. These, like these, have the vintage, and have have the color too, and it's just gorgeous. Love, love, love. those two yeah. this one here is called hydrangea Gia. hydrangea I think I'm still I'm pronouncing that right and this has bunnies in it so I'm really looking forward to using this as Easter look at those cute or what and then you have what looks like yeah Cute, cute, cute. Oh, look at that one. And you've got the back print. Beautiful. Look at that pink. The little way. Love it. Great printing on the back of this one. Hope I'm not going through these too fast. This looks like an egg of some sort. The bunnies. Oh, this one's nice, eh? With the lace over top of the words. The hanging back. I gotta keep these things down. I'm all excited here, lifting them up on you. And this one here look like poppies, don't they? Those red ones. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And this one is an Easter one too. Well, I don't know if the hydrangea one is Easter, but um, it's got bunnies, so I could think of it as Easter. But this one's just called Easter here. Oh, oh, eggs coming down. What? <laughs> oh my gosh, those are cute. And look at him. So adorable. Love these. So 
such a great piece for a journal. This with the maps and back. <laughs> Look at this. Is that cute or what? Oh, and look at the cut of parts. Look. Oh, I love him. He reminds me, um, my, I think it's my second cousin. She paints. Um, and it reminds me a lot of one that she did where she was, um, doing, uh, uh, hair that was running. Very pretty. Love, love, love. And just two more. And then I'll be guys and leave you guys to go shopping. <laughs> oh. oh, this, sorry. I, this is called uh, Lamour. I should be able to pronounce that better with Mario speaking French, but l'amour, l'amour, yeah, l'amour, I don't know. I um, have been with him 20 years and his mother still doesn't like how I say his name. So what are you going to do? Forget me not. Oh, look at these. Vintage Valentine. Very nice. Oh, nice and bright, but vintagey at the same time. It's gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Get me not another good journaling one. Bridal song. Vintage text. Got some really, really nice vintage elements, and she's so cute, a little fairy. Very nice. And one last one, you guys. Um, I will uh, show, which is Dreamland. If I can get it open. Yeah, it's called Dreamland.
I love the peachy colors in this. Oh, look, look at the wood background in that. Love. Love, love, love. Oh, and look at the faint music. Oh, look at the tickets. Love tickets. It's beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I like how they got color, yet you have grays that just fit in <laughs> they just somehow fit <laughs> beautiful oh, love them love them love them i know i kept you guys for a while I, I really just went, and that's why I didn't do the dies as well. I really wanted to take the time, the time to go through these paper pads because they are so beautiful. Um, so I will be doing projects with a few of them so that you can see what you can make. However, if you want to dive right into purchasing them, I will put the links below to Panalisa, the official store for Panalisa. Um, I will put there the store's um, link below as well and any other names that are needed. And yeah, I um, encourage you to go take a look because, yeah, it's a really good store with really good, really good pricing. So, um, yeah, I look forward to uh, doing some uh, projects for you and displaying them on camera. All right. Thanks, you guys.